car. You won't believe this. My parents are taking me on safari. I'm going to miss the prom. No way! Oh, it won't be the same without you. Hi. Do you know anything about this bimbo TJ was with last night? I'm so P.O.'d. You guys all witnessed this blatant, slime buckety, dishonest, sleazy, weasel. Hold on, I got another call. Hello? Hold on. It's TJ, as in total jerk, good for nothing, low down, cheating. What? That girl was his cousin? Oh my god. Don't go anywhere, I'll be right back. TJ? Hi. Uh-huh. Cool. Okay. I'll be right back. Hold on. Kim? Guess what? I'm going to the prom with Mr. Slime Buckety Weasel. Is this great or what? 911. Love crisis operator. May I help you? Whoa, did you get up on the wrong side of the bed? <laughs> Don't ask. I've had a long morning and I'm not even out of bed. Well, just go back to sleep and pretend this is all a dream. I just want to let you know that last night was great and I can't stop thinking about you. really pretty. Oh boy. Wasn't that fashion show the best? Oh, I can't wait to see what you look like in your gown, Kimmy. It's mm -hmm. beautiful. You guys are great for my ego. I'm speechless. Did you see that gold dress coming down the runway? That was speechless. Yeah, right. Thousands of dollars later. No way. It was the attitude, not the price tag. All right. See you. See you later, Kimmy. Honey, Brett's here. Is this really the same little girl? that just started kindergarten a few years ago. Dad's trying to say we love you and have a good time. Hello, Brett. How you doing, Mr. Lee? Hi, Brett. Miss Lee. Yeah, Kim, these are for you. And Cowboy Hats for a big concert next week. We're going front row. Whoa! Wow, you really look beautiful tonight, Kim. Are you ready? And that's it. Talk about your anticlimaxes, and it's the end of the game. The only remaining scene thereafter is a, a credits scene, which, to be honest, I'm not showing you, because I don't think anyone involved with this game deserves any form of credit whatsoever. So, uh, yeah, that's the end of Mackenzie & Co. Uh, I guess it leaves us with a lingering question of... What happens to Kim? What's Kim's ultimate fate? Well, to be honest, we just don't know. Is she abducted in the night by that guy, or does she put it in, or have it put in her, or... Does she retire to some sort of pastoral existence with that horse? I don't even know what happens at the prom, it's just completely arbitrary ending. And, uh, to be honest, I, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. I'm just really glad to finish this game and never have to play it again. I don't think I'm going to play any of the other boys, but someday, in several years' time when I'm retired or something, maybe we can talk about it. Thank you all so much for watching, it's been a really gruelling experience. And as a reward, here's a blooper I've re I really enjoyed, to be honest. Um, it's a bit of a callback to a previous episode, so for all you guys have been watching for a while, hope you enjoy this recurrent error I seem to get once every couple of years. Thanks again for watching. Did you get it? Well, did you? Did you? Well, of course! Now, what for a slumber party without a totally illegal and bad copy of the Yeah! I can't wait to see it. I'm gonna go find Carly and meet us out at the home. Ciao. He was a Texas cowboy, always so fine. Texas cowboy, I'm gonna make him my oh, how hard Carly. Romeo, Romeo, wherefore art thou, Romeo? Deny that all the and you thy name, if thou wilt.
Hey. Hey. Aloha.